Yo, what's up guys? We're here at my secret skate spot. We're gonna go over three awesome beginner tricks you can learn before you learn how to ollie. Those three tricks are the throw down, the scoop, and the hop flip. Let's get on it. As you can see, I'm wearing a helmet because wearing protective gear is smart and you always wanna wear a helmet and pads when you're learning new tricks, guys. All right, step one for the throw down is you hold out the board with your left hand as if you're walking with the skateboard. Let the tail of the board sit on the ground and you wanna lift your left leg up and kind of bend your knee up like this. And as you let the board drop, you step on the board in a riding stance and then you just do a little push and then you ride with it. Lean forward. Next step of the throw down is to hold it out with your left hand but now you're gonna let the tail drag across the flat surface as you walk with it. And you have to time your step with your left foot onto the front of the skateboard as you're walking with it. Just hold it on the side of your body, then let it down and then step onto it. Riding stance, lean forward, bend your knees, skate away. And then once you get really good at them, you can do them a lot faster and you don't even need to think about it. This next trick is called the scoop. You put your back right foot in the pocket right here, right on the side of the tail, and kind of cup your toes around this part of the tail. And what you do for the scoop is take your back foot and put it behind the board. Always be careful when you're doing the scoop that you put your back foot far enough behind you so when you do the scoop, the board doesn't come out and flip around and get you hit your leg and your right foot's almost at a 45 degree angle and then you just do a slight push on the tail and then you do a scoop backward making the board do a 180 like so making the board do a 180 like so And that is called the scoop. After you get that motion down of doing it with one footed, then you can do it and try to land on both feet like that. And this is really beneficial in learning shove it and pop shove it, maybe even, even impossibles. Make sure you guys smash like if you're getting value out of this video and also comment if you have any questions about your skateboarding tricks. Also subscribe for more skate videos and make sure you guys stay tuned for the extra trick tip at the end of this video. Also when you learn the scoop it's also really good so once you get the normal scoop down with your normal stance you can switch to your switch stance and try a switch scoop just like this. Get that pop in the scoop. All right, and that really helps you get that switch shoves down, nolly shoves. Absolutely, learn them, switch scoops. My last trick is the favorite trick of, of all these tricks called the hop flip. So you wanna take your board, flip it upside down, tail end there, nose end there, take your right foot, put that right foot right under the board, and basically all you do is pull up on your toes and then push down with the bottom of your foot. Hop up and push down. And that's the hop flip. What's really cool with this flip, this trick, is you can actually flip it up and you can actually get really used to doing it with that foot. And then you could actually go back and try it with your other foot. And after you get them down with both feet, you can try doing one foot to two feet. And then you can do left foot to right feet, two feet. Or you can just do the normal popcorn where you do two feet on, right on. Bam. And this will really help you learn how to do your kick flips. It really helps you learn how to catch the board when you're doing the kick flips with your back foot. Especially when you do it with your back right foot for regular because the board flips around and you catch it. You catch the kick flips with your back right foot. And it's opposite of your goofy. That little secret trick tip I was going to tell you about is learn how to kick flip. A lot of people don't get their ollies down. So make sure when you're trying your kickflips, do an ollie before you do your kickflip, then you'll know 
if your ollie's straight and high enough and solid enough to try that kickflip just like this. That really helps you get your kickflips down when you know you can do your ollies. Nice and strong, straight, high, solid. All right guys, thanks for watching Skate Tutors. Make sure you guys click on one of the screens for more beginner skateboarding trick tip videos. Peace out guys.